Take care of your money presented by U.S. Bank Flex Perks Rewards Cards. What's the point of collecting points if 36,000 points gets you this? Or 50,000 points gets you from here to here? Tired of your points being pointless? With a Flex Perks Rewards Card, 20,000 points can get you a $400 airline ticket. Flex points go farther. Apply today at U.S. Bank. Well, the way we heat our homes is about to change, and if you take action now, it could save you some cold, hard cash. Carol Evans' Jeffrey DeMars has tonight's Take Care of Your Money report. For the most part, the furnace is one of the most reliable things inside your home, generally good for about 20 years. Some homes even still have working ones from yesteryear. Most people forget they have a box in the basement that heats their house <laughs> until there's a problem and then it's a big issue. These days there's a burning issue in the furnace business. While most newer furnaces operate at about 80 percent fuel efficiency, new federal regulations go into effect next year. You may not install one after May 1st. Um, so there's a line drawn in the sand and once we hit that point, they will no longer be for sale in this area. It's out with the 80 and in with the 90 on May 1st in the northern half of the United States, including Minnesota. Any furnace installed must be at least 90 percent fuel efficient. This will mean a couple of things. First, the more fuel efficient furnace will cost at minimum a few hundred dollars more. Secondly, installation. It's not as simple as swapping out the old with the new. The new 90 percent furnaces cannot vent into an existing B vent flu or a chimney liner or some, uh, you know, a standard flu. Bottom line with the new furnace, you're going to need not one, but two new lines that are made of PVC pipe and that run outside of the house. One line for the air intake and the other for the air exhaust, and both must have direct access outside. This could pose a challenge if your furnace is located in the center of your home or in the basement. Having to add two additional lines could turn what was a simple furnace install into additional construction costs. Interior condo units and some apartments will also be more of a challenge and could potentially double the cost of a new furnace installation. By the time you figure out all the drywall repair, the carpentry, the soft, softening, the painting and finishing and, and stuff like that. It could turn a $3,000 project into $6,000, but if you purchase before May, it can be avoided. Anybody who's got a furnace that's, you know, 12, 13, 14 years old might want to start thinking about this. Um, it could save them a lot of money in the long run. And prevent them from watching their cash go up in flames. Jeffrey DeMars, CARE 11 News. Well, the newer furnaces are more fuel efficient and are expected to reduce your home heating bill. However, experts say it could take five to 10 years to recoup your costs. While us in the north have to make adjustments, so do those in the south where they'll be required to have more efficient air conditioning units. I